Hi there, once again, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Consider subscribing if today is your first time and don't forget to turn on post notification. Today, I'm going to take you through a tour of my Facebook new page experience. So, this is my page, and I made a video on how to get a new page experience. And I explained that you shouldn't change any category, it's a gradual process, and Facebook is actually going to do that automatically for you. So, over here, I have several, I have several Facebook pages. So, if you check from here, I have about six of my Facebook pages already converted into the new page experience. The new page experience actually make your page looks more decent, more organized. And you can easily switch between your pages and then use them as a normal Facebook profile page. Okay, so this is how my main Facebook page is looking. The entire contact has now been moved to the top here. Your followers and then who you are following it's now move above here so you can see i have a, a, over 7k followers everything move over here i have everything summarized over here and if you come down here instead of just having one pin post you cannot add featured posts okay under services recent videos and normal posts as well so everything is well organized and you can easily switch this into a grid and then add a more currently i'm using my normal facebook page and I'm going to switch back to my main page. So I'm going to use this page for demonstration. Consider subscribing if today is your first time visiting my channel. Don't forget to turn on post notification so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorial. So because I'm using my normal Facebook profile, I have some limit as to how I can modify my page. So what I'll do is I'll go here and actually click on this are the new page experience that I have been converted into new page experience you don't need to do anything it's a gradual process and facebook will do that for you so over right here i'm going to switch from my main profile to my facebook new page experience this one just select that and it's going to switch that for you so you can see the process now i'm within my new page experience so it's going to act like just a normal facebook profile when you switch you can see you can write what's on your mind how you take that's my page and you can just look at everything it's going to give you a summary of your post reach and post engagements new followers it's going to do that for you and give you some summary over here but when you click on this this will not take you to the page so you can see now we have the page and we have the professional dashboard the insights and there's a lot you can do over here so this page is actually world organized when you come down here you can see i have managed i've actually featured some relevant information of my recent video you can easily do that and instead of just having just one post over a spin post now you can do more than that you can post our services you can add recent videos and then you can see i have additional posts over here and this is amazing once you pin the post you can do that and if you come down here you have all your posts that you made your post by default is going to be in a list view and you can switch that to a grid view so when you do this it's going to break your post into what column so you can see everything is now in a grid mode you can see post by year post by year and then month so i'm going to organize this for you and everything will now look amazing you can see the date and everything and one other good thing is that you can easily go ahead and then click on manage post or you can filter posts. So if you want to look at posts you made in 2021, all you can do is to click on what filter. You can do this, it's going to give you this simple pop up and you can click and select the year you want. So let's say I want to see the posts I made in 2021, I can just click over there. And if you want the specific month, you can do that. But if you want all the months, you can just click on done. Let's say I want to look at the posts I made in August 2021, I can just select that and click what I guess from here and click what done. And look at this, it's going to give me August 2021. This is how the post I made in August 2021. It's going to give me everything in the grid view. If I want it in the list, I can do that. So, this is going to give you some of that. So, this is my August post. Post that I made in August, everything is listed over here. And if you move down, it's going to give you the list of other months. So, this is July. If you move down, it's going to give you the list like that. So I'll switch everything in towards the grid view. So, this is how amazing this page. It's going to look like and you have an amazing menu down here for you to manage your base, your insights. So instead of you having 
your page follower is displayed which ordinarily is displayed over here everything has now been moved to the top over here don't worry just uh, just relax it's a gradual process and it will get to your 10 facebook is going to switch your page to what the new page experience so you don't have to rush to anything in order to get this this is a gradual process and everyone is going to have access to that so you see how amazing this is going to be there's a start to so if you want to look at how this is going to be so i'm going to start a talk so if i go ahead and click on view us i can view us what viewers will see when they visit my facebook page so this is what and a new viewer will come to my pages for the person will see the person will see a follow button the person will be easily the person can easily follow me the person can see a messenger button the person can also see a whatsapp so these are this is view so these are ways people can easily use to contact when the person can follow me and the person can start seeing my posts when I make them and the person can message me also message me what's up and you can see how neat this is going to be the featured posts that you make will all be displayed over here the person can easily go scroll through see your services and all that so all you also see how everything is well organized and your posts will all be displayed so everything is now all arranged and it's neat so let me exit from the view mode and you can easily go to the professional dashboard from here and also inside when you click over here it will take you to the professional dashboard so this will take you to the professional dashboard there's a lot you can do here you can configure your whatsapp map irrelevant messages you can easily do a lot over here within the professional mode during the so you can do a lot over here when you move to the professional dashboard so you can see the last 28 days this is how my page was doing i reached about 133,158 my post read it and i post engagement 3,000 and the new followers that i had so, okay so with a new page experience is going to help you do a lot have other tools so my event jobs page access message settings link account top phone i can easily do a lot of here. so just relax it will get your 10 pretty soon and then you should be able to have access to amazing tools to even go further have better engagement on social media there's a lot of people visiting social media like every day and there so you should be able to take critical or better use of your page and then you can do a lot with that so you see just a page overview i'm going to give you a summary of everything my share comment post view link and process everything is going to be well displayed within this the professional dashboard so another professional dashboard this amazing tools over here you can easily use and so you can also create a post direct from here like subscribe for more video on the new page experience i'll be doing more on that more updates when there's any update that will help you improve your business i'll make that available on this page so let's assume you want to add this featured post you can just click on manage when you click on this money you can see it'll be a plus icon over here when you click on the plus icon this is where you can add and also remove so you can see this post has been pinned if i don't want to pin this post i can just click on that and i'll remove that there's a scroll button here if i don't want to the services to display i can just click on that and then remove it from the pin post so this is not going to display at the top if i want to event i can do that at the moment i just want to display just this this new upcoming training i'll just leave that for now so you can easily add more than one ordinarily you should be able to do one when you are using the normal page just pin one point but now you have the option to add more than one so you see the plus icon that will help you to be able to add more pin messages as featured image now on what facebook new page experience subscribe for more video on my channel there's a lot i'll be sharing with you how to grow on social media i'll share that with you so this is just the beginning the new page experience everyone is going to have access to that i haven't done anything i have a six of that i have a 14 pages in total and already have been converted already into the new page experience i've not done anything i've not changed any category it has been moved direct so you see this page is under computer company so it has been converted into the new page experience so just take your time relax and everything will happen for you automatically thank you for visiting my channel once again like subscribe and turn on post notification for more of my videos till i come away again
Bye-bye.